hi guys you're welcome back to my channel if you are stopping by for the very first time you're most definitely welcome and if you are my returning subscriber you're welcome as well if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my youtube channel and be part of this beautiful and wonderful family today's video I'm going to we're going to be talking about how our parents conceive me be me marrying a teacher right yeah. so but before we do that I did our last video how we met as in we, we are so so happy we want to thank all the people that subscribed to that video we want to thank all the people that viewed that video the views we are so so massive and you're welcome viewers thank you for everything like i said uh she accepted okay she as a person has said yes okay so that was a pass mark that was like 50 percent out of 100 so we went straight i called her parents or we tried to call them but they didn't pick up because she gave me her number i tried to call the man the man didn't pick up i don't know i don't know why so I told her that she should go and tell the man that I want to see him. He refused. He said, no, I can't see him. When I, when I told my dad, my dad was like, he, like he was shocked hearing the news that I want to get married. He asked me, do you actually know what you want to do? You just came out of school and uh, you just want to get married. Can't you think about your life, think about yourself and every other thing? that i've not gotten to the age of getting married so that was the main reason why he kept quiet without saying anything so the second time he i told him again about the stuff that daddy please the man that wants to marry me won't come and see you he was like shut up what are you saying that <laughs> i don't i don't i don't know what i'm saying that okay that was even when he gave me the audience. He asked me, where is the man from? I told him Delta State. He asked me, you, you, if I'm, you want to marry a Delta man? You want to marry? Is there anything wrong in marrying a... I asked him if there is anything wrong. He said, no, that if at all I want to marry, if I thought it's going to approve any marriage that is going to be from my state, that's Anambra State. I was like, ha. Huh. I went to meet my mom. I told my mom, my mom said I should calm down, that it's slow, slow and steady. So my dad, after talking to my mom, she invited me actually. Yeah. She invited me and I went to her shop. She was selling. I talked to her like a son to a mother. She could see, she could see it in me that me not to worry, that I should calm down, that she knows how she will talk to her husband. So. I went back home. My parents were actually in a rush to get me married very fast. So they were really disturbed. I told them not to worry that everything will go fine. This is the person I've chosen and definitely I will let me get married to her. It's just going to waste small of my time. So the woman went, she did so many, many talkings. The man didn't agree. The man didn't actually allow me to come see him, just to see him. We've not even talked about. The intro we're just talking about not let me see him let me know him yeah he called me one day because then i was he called me he asked me if this is actually what i want i don't know what who we'll talked to him but that day he was talking to me i was so happy if this is actually what i want i said yes this is what i want daddy if you can do this for me this is the only thing i've asked you if you can do it for me, I'm going to be happy. I'm going to, going to be the most happiest person. He said, okay, no problem, dad. But he's still having issue with the state. I said, daddy, what happened now? Is it that you, you've had experience with Delta people? Delta people or, I mean, just tell me. He said, you, you will not understand that. It's not that he had experience, but he don't just want me to marry at least i should marry from my state so that the love will be i told him that love is everywhere if you marry an outside person 
it's the same love so far the both of you love each and other each and other. understand each other sure. so he said okay no problem that he's going to think about it i think after yeah. thinking about it that was when he asked me one day i was at father at home cleaning my shoes my shelf and every other thing she called me and she said guess what i said well you know i'm not good at guess game so i so i got this call she said the dad wanted to see me it's just as if i won a lottery <laughs> i was really so happy oh so me, me that was calling daddy i was so so happy as i yes i was so happy. happy that i had to go out jump outside to buy drinks for my friend i don't drink but we celebrated it in a very big way so it was a saturday so next week sunday I, pre I prepared myself i went to their house so on getting to the front of their house you know when i was in front of their house i could feel my heart rate beating so fast it was beating so fast i was so surprised that's so can you could be so scared of a woman being greeted by god i could not step in i was just coming myself but then i just got in i saw a slim fair man just slim as in i was like wow so this man gave me that kind of stress so immediately i comported myself i talked to him we talked lengthily but you could see the first thing they did was not we didn't talk straight away they brought food for me very big food i was like wow this is yeah. hospitality no matter it. what we welcome our visitors. the food no was so what. nice and delicious i okay after eating but what i was eating the man was looking at me with <laughs> one corner eyes i was like wow mm. <laughs> hope this is not going to be the last supper so after eating after eating we talked for like three hours he was asking me a lot of questions uh what i do for a living uh, where i i told him i'm a teacher where i teach we'll talk lengthily about that so he said okay that he he really welcomed me thank you for coming everything but he said for him to agree finally finally and to place our introduction date and everything i have to visit some couple of people he gave us like five yeah. names, right? Yeah, like, five, like five, five names. To six names. Five to six names. Yeah, <laughs> he asked me to actually go and bring a barrel and, and a book. And a book. <laughs> and he started writing. My dad is very funny. Very, 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 very funny. funny. He gave us the list of people to go and actually visit before he finally said, Yes, you can place your introduction. So, you know, I was, this me that's have been long in a very long while. I was like, Ah, oh, anywhere I will go. But I forgot that Lagos traffic is a hell. So immediately we stepped out, we started, but we could not even do more than one visit that day. Yeah. I think we used four days to four complete days, yes. the whole four yeah, days. the four days to complete the whole list. Thereafter, after doing that, after satisfying his uh what's called requirement, he said, Okay. What are their reply? We told him what is um, told us that they gave us their blessings. He said, Okay, that's very good. That I should go back home. I was like, sir. Okay, I was expecting. Yeah, so so so. Now this is the day you're going to do your introduction. He, he said, said it's not done that way. He said it's not done that way. That they don't rush marriage. Yeah. After visiting and everything, I was mad. I was losing it. I was losing this thing. So I had to just go home. My parents called me. They calmed me down. So they calmed me down. Mm, I waited for at least two months, right? Yeah, two we months. Waited for two months. Another two months. Another two months. He now called. He said we can come. We now fixed a date for the introduction. So when I called my parents, they were so happy. They came all the way from Lagos because I uh, went away from Akure because we did the introduction in Lagos. We came, everybody met each other, we exchanged pleasantries, each families were well represented, they were happy. But I think when we left, my daughter told me that. He was skeptical. He, he called you and he Okay, asked, he called me and sure asked yes i think he was being careful the reason why he did not actually want to i think he trusted people from anambra state i think that's the main reason because i got to know that he trusted people from anambra state more than i don't know maybe he, he has owned a business with a delta person once before in, a, in his life he asked me if actually this is my husband's parents that have i seen them before i said yes i've seen them before this is the father i don't know why he asked i asked him he said nothing because you never can trust people rent uh, parents to come and do traditional uh, marriage to come and do introduction uh, to come and do introduction and traditional marriage and all of that 
I said yes that he's the my father in law, he's my father in law. Um <laughs> So uh so we waited that was a pass for us, we did the introduction. So we now waited for another like uh Three months. Again, yeah. Yes, three only like months. three months for them yeah. to get the list. The list. It was taking a long time, as in to bring a list. I was today. I will call him. Good afternoon, sir. sir. The list. He said, yes, they are still working on it. You know, when you hear the word, they are still working on your list. You get scared. <laughs> I was like, wow. Are you sure I won't buy a house? <laughs> they were telling me, okay, you have to wait more. The list will be prepared. The list will be prepared. Da 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 da. It took them like three good months again before they send down the list. So when he sent the list to me, he called me, he said the list is here. I went there with my kinsmen who collected the list. So when I got home, I perused the list. I went through it. I saw everything lined up. Wow, <laughs> sincerely speaking. When I say... He was so mad. I was mad. He was so mad. He said he, he's not marrying again. He's sincerely not, speaking. He sincerely said he's speaking. not marrying again. That's what I said. I, I had to stop begging him as in... Even the bed, he didn't agree that day. I had to go home and start praying. As in, start praying. He's not even waiting for my parents again. We are talking about the list now. And the list is here and he said, he's not getting married again. Can you see? Ah. Now, 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 Can actually, you? in the list, as a person, I was expecting something like 250000 to wrap up everything. That's everything in the list. Aside the diary, at least everything, two hundred fifty. But when I saw the list, it was like a two full page list. What's two full page? Like four page. Yes, run back. Like four I pages. Think, it was I up think... to four pages. They liked everything. Omwada, omune, so many, many, many. It was so much that as in the drinks there can actually start up a brewery. <laughs> it was so much that I had to now calculate. At the end of the day, we paid. When I calculated everything, everything it was it was so much. It was so but much. But we paid everything. But thank they, God, couldn't, they couldn't reduce anything. They didn't reduce anything. They didn't so reduce we anything. had to. They didn't reduce we had anything. no choice. He I thank God. Not that I thank God for my parents. I thank God for my parents and every other person that supported me. I was able to actually pay everything on the list. That's how I got married to her today. Traditionally, so. So, what's your advice on uh, that you give to Nigerian parents the way they? Treats their children based on marriage issues. Uh, sincerely speaking, if if I must say anything on this, I would advise as a parents to actually give out their daughters or sons to anybody they want to. So far, the child or the daughter says, "This is the person I want." Then let them be. Don't make life so difficult. Like as a person, I don't pray for my siblings or my children to go through such because it was it was disheartening. I nearly lost it. I nearly lost it.